and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code PULA at checkout for 20% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team Video Guide. And today, I'm going to be going over the brand new LTT Legend for the Super Bowl Playoffs type promo. And as you guys know, very rare EA drops content on Sundays. Very rare. And when they do, they don't tell you about it. Very stupid. As per usual, guys, EA did drop content on a Sunday. A surprise content drop that no one knew about. We only know about it because of Twitter. So what happened was I was like eight minutes into a video. I was almost done with it. I was going to post it for you guys. Get it all up. Good thing I got Xerxes called me real quick and let me know that the LTD had just come out. And EA didn't say anything about it. They didn't tweet about it. They didn't Twitch. Nothing. So we had no idea. So I was going to post the video not knowing there was some brand new content for you guys. And like, am I supposed to just on Sundays check the auction block for specific filters to see if there's a new card there? Kind of frustrating that EA did it that way. But am I surprised? Not really. They, this is like the time that Le'Veon Bell came out and it was like a Sunday randomly and they just dropped the LTD Le'Veon Bell and I found it on the auction block because I was trying to sell my running back. And it, it was just just funny the way EA works. You'd think they'd want to tell you about their content so we'd open more packs. I find it funny. It's like they almost didn't know they were dropping this today. As far as what packs to open, probably Legend Fantasy Bundle is probably the best bet. I mean, maybe Super Bowl Bundle because he is a Super Bowl card. So it comes down to whatever you guys want. I mean, Super Bowl packs probably better for him specifically. But I don't always like the odds of the Super Bowl packs versus Legend Fantasy Bundles. Up to you guys. But if you're into the channel, go down below. Hit that subscribe button. Boys, turn the noti bell. Come join the family. Let's get to 20k as quickly as possible. For the surprise 1030 content, can we get 300 likes in the video? That'd be greatly appreciated, boys. Spam the like button. See if we can get to 300 likes. I'd appreciate each and every one of you that can hit that. Let us set the goal today. Now, the new card is Mel Renfro, as you guys can see. Right here, 96 overall. Mel Renfro, Super Bowl Pass, LTD. Now, I wish they would have told us about him. That would have been super cool. He's got the band-aid looking archetype, which I don't entirely know what that is for the most part. LTD, so obviously you can he's gonna be expensive. His quick sell is, I believe, what is it, 250? So yeah, he's gonna be at least above 250, which he's 96 overall. He's probably gonna be he's probably gonna be around like 600, 700k when all is said and done. Can be powered up. Remember, he does have a theme diamond, so if you want to power him up, you do have to pick up his theme diamond first. And then power him up all the way. Probably can get him to like a 98 overall, real easily chemed up. Now let's compare him to a cornerback and check out his stats. Actually, let's do his stats first. Do his stats one by one. So he's six feet tall. Six feet tall. Average height, solid height. 93 speed's amazing. 94 speed, 94 cells amazing. 95 agility is amazing. 95 jumping is amazing. 92 player X great. 94 man, 95 zone amazing. 82 press is kind of weak. Not gonna lie. I thought he was a little bit more physical than that. 82 press is kind of weak. 71 strength. His catching's 80. So he's like, he kind of looks like a Deion Sanders type build. A Deion Sanders, a slightly less athletic, a little less juke, a little less spin. Uh, let's see what else he's got. Does he got a hit power? Spectacular catch, 78. Hit power, 78. Okay, he's like a weird hybrid like Deion Sanders. I don't really know what to call this card. Not bad, though. Let's compare it to one of our cornerbacks. See what he's looking like. Compared to Night Train Lane, which is a physical type corner. All righty, eh? That's good, too. Yeah, just, don't, just don't show it. All right, so he destroys the, he destroys Night Train Lane everywhere except for press. Now, speed's slight. Excel's a good amount. Agility's a good amount. Jumping slight. Play rec is a little bit... Man coverage is by a lot, and zones by a little bit. Press, he loses by a lot. But again, you can still power up this Mel Renfro and chem up, do a lot. You could probably get, you could easily get his man in zone close to like 99. So you can have like 99 zone, 99 man. The only issue is that you're not going to be able to press him, which does kind of suck. Now, this is, now let's compare him to his counterpart, Mel Blunt. And let's see. Yeah, he blows away Mel Blunt almost everywhere. Oh, yeah. Just the press. The press is the only thing that really hurts him. The car's looking pretty solid, though. Compare him to Deion Sanders. Less speed, less excel, less agility, better jump, better play rec. Less man, better zone, similar press. I'm telling you, this is a slower Deion Sanders. It's just a slower Deion Sanders. That's all it is. Now, I'd probably rather still have Deion. Like, if I, if I can't get it, the only reason that you take Deion is because he's crazy. Like you, 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 you could forget about his press because it's Deion Sanders. I don't know if I could forget about the press on other cards. Like, you forget about Deion Sanders' press because he has speed, juke, spin, interceptions, kick returns. You forget about everything else, right? Lockdown, crazy plays. Mel Renfro, I don't know if you could justify the speed drop. Obviously, he's going to be one of the best corners in the game right now. Still an insane card. I just don't, I think I only want one of those guys. Like, I have Dion, right? I don't think I want two guys without press. So, in my opinion, if it's either like you take Dion or Mel Renfro, because you really can't press, you can't play up, which does kind of suck, because guys with good press can really lock down some receivers. It's really up to you guys on this, uh, on that standpoint. Now, I kind of want to open up some Super Bowl packs. I might test my test the waters with a few Super Bowl packs, see if I can pull them. Kind of interested to see if we can get a decent pull out of these. I'm, I don't know. Feels a little risky, guys. I don't know. Break tackle 82. Now, I don't know what... 
I wonder what guy, right, was just, like, sitting there and just pulling packs to get a gold. And he was like, oh, my God, Mel Renfro, who the hell is this? Now, the thing is that it's probably a guy who doesn't even keep up Madden that much, so he didn't even know, like, oh, yeah, it's probably out, whatever. But, like, me, if I pull something like that, I'd go crazy. Like, I'm on top of the content. I didn't even know it was out. It just, it just, you know, it's crazy, right? You'd think that they'd announce this kind of stuff. I don't know why they're not telling people about this stuff. Now, I'm going to open up a few Super Bowl packs, see if we could pull anything. It'd be really fire if we could pull, like, if, if we pull them, guys, that'd be a crazy title for you guys. I'm going to open up a Super Bowl pack. I'm going to go one by one. I'm going to evaluate what we lose versus what we get, and if, it, if it's worth it, it's worth it. All right, so we get we got a silver right here. Ezekiel Turner, 62. Move on over. All right, we got a power up. Give me Lamar Jackson. Kendall Fuller, just talking about him actually in the other videos recording. And we get a Super Bowl card, and it is a 90 Robert Al Ro Robert Robert Alford. Okay, we made like 20K right there. Robert. Rabbit. I don't even know what I was calling him. Solid pull right there. All right. So we got to open another one, right? That's what I'm saying. I'm, I'm evaluating risk loss here, right? We, we gained, so I can definitely afford one more pack here. At least minimum. If it's really bad, no. But we got to get this LTD card. I've never pulled an LTD before. And I've especially never pulled anything good on camera before. All right. I don't know what the animations look like, really. 82 Russell Okung and a power up Marlon Humphrey. Okay, we're going to open up one more. If it's good, we keep going. If it's really bad, we stop there. Hopefully, it's fire because I really don't feel like going home empty-handed today. All right. First card, silver. Farrell Cooper. Another Super Bowl card right here. We get 82 Russell Okung. Oh, God. How do you differentiate the, the animations? I really, I really don't know. I mean, what does this card sell for? Like 10k. So I probably lost like 40k. And then I made the 50k. So I probably lost like, probably lost like 20k so far, which really isn't that bad. We're gonna open up one more Super Bowl pack, boys. Comment down below. Pood luck. I don't know. Comment down below. Give me some luck, boys, before I open this pack. Hopefully, we can pull an LTD. I've never like, you, if you guys have been watching, you know, I've, I've never pulled an LTD in my whole Madden career. Been playing since Madden 13. Never pulled a single LTD card ever. Ever. It should never happen. I mean, I've never been a big pack guy, but at one point I was when I was really young. But, comment down below, luck. We're going to take this one slow. Watch the first card be the Super Bowl card. I don't want it that fast. I want to take my time with this pack. All right, we got a silver. Chris Smith on the Browns. Okay, we're going to go run to the right. Another gold. Okay. We got Alan Hearns. Solid, solid receiver. I'm scared. Right here. Okay, gold. Michael Roberts. See, if it was, if it was Mel Renfro, I don't even know what I would do. I'd probably go wild. All right, all right, sounds like the final card. All right. Boys, comment down below, Luck. Can we get a LTD pull right here? And I don't know the difference. We got 86 Eli Manning. I don't know what those go for. Purchase five packs from the store. Thank you. Thank you for that 2K back. All right, we just lost, I believe that was 140K. So let's see how much we gain back from that. Guys, personal advice, I don't recommend ever opening the packs. The only decent thing about those packs is that like it's a guaranteed return because you automatically get a Super Bowl player and they're all elites. So it's not like you're not, it's not like you're going to lose a ton of coins, but it's not like you're going to gain a bunch of, let's see, Eli Manning goes for 12K. Oh, we probably lost like 70K right there. Wasn't the smartest thing I've ever done, but again, it's for the content. Hopefully you guys do enjoy. Uh, tried my luck there. I tried my luck with Eli as well. No, no luck as well. Guys, it is what it is, right? We have to take the good with the bad, but there's been a lot more bad than good when it comes to my packs. But guys, coming in Madden 21, I'm telling you, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be spamming some packs. I'm going to pull an LTD for you guys in that first month. Write it down. I'm gonna be opening up a ton of packs. I will pull an LTD. I've never pulled them before, and this is, this is the year. This is gonna be my year to pull one. Robert Alford, your 44k, perfect. Sell you up. We probably lost about 70k. Well, it wasn't horrible. Like, I mean, it could have been a lot worse. Gave us a decent chance on camera, but it is what it is, guys. I pretty much covered. That's pretty much it for the video. I hope you guys did enjoy. I hope you guys liked that Mel Renfro. Today's the Pro Bowl, so I was kind of hoping for Pro Bowl content rather than LTD card. But, I mean, oh, not LTD, let me rephrase that. I was hoping for an LTD Pro Bowl player like LTD Calvin Johnson from the 2013 Pro Bowl. That would have been cool. That's the content we need, EA. Mel Renfro's fine. Not going to complain. But we have so many cornerbacks. And we're probably going to need a Richard Sherman or like a Kendall Fuller. We didn't need much more for this moment in time. We need some awesome... I don't know why they don't drop Pro Bowl content anymore. Maybe they will. Maybe maybe tonight after the Pro Bowl, they'll drop like the... Ooh, Pro Bowl MVP. That's a card they should drop. That's a good card. But guys, it is about it for the video. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to go down below. Hit that subscribe button, boys. Turn on the naughty bell. Come join the family. I appreciate each and every one of you that come out on a daily basis. Come watch the vids. So thank you guys for all that. Let's get to 20K as quickly as possible, boys. You guys have been killing it lately. Let's keep growing. Comment down below. 
Hopefully you guys gave me some free luck there, and I mean, we, we kind of got a Robert Alford, so that was cool. Comment down below what you think of the Mel Renfro, and make sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Can we get 300 likes on our 1030 video? That'd be greatly appreciated, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'm out. See you guys next time. Check out the rest of the videos for today. We now have three. It was going to be a two-upload day. We now have three because I was recording one, and I was almost done with it, and then they dropped this. So enjoy the third video for the day, guys. Hopefully you guys enjoy. I'm out. See you in the next video. Peace.